This is from the Bleacher Report. NFL free agents that teams will regret spending big money on. So we've said we don't want to spend big money. So um, this is according to the Bleacher Report. They say Alan Lazard. Spot track estimates his annual market value to be in the $12.5 million. That doesn't appear to be an overpay given the uh, gonzo salaries of receivers. Um, but Lazard never had even 800 yards in a season, and he's caught over 50 passes just once. That's playing with Aaron Rodgers. And then they say Deron Payne. A $20 million defensive lineman needs to be more than good. He has to wreak havoc and take over games. Payne did so in 2022. He had only 14 and a half sacks over his first four seasons combined. Paying huge money for one big season has backfired on NFL teams plenty of times before. Um, cautionary tales. You know, everybody likes Deron Payne, a young guy, but I, yeah. The problem is, is if you spend that and, it, and he doesn't produce, it's not good. Yeah, or if you spend that and he's hurt for a couple games. I yeah. mean, the Browns' defensive tackle room was not one player away. If they were one player away, $20 million Deron Payne makes a ton of sense. Whoever gets him is going to get an absolute animal. He is a terrific player. I, I have no qualms about saying that Deron Payne is a stud. Uh, it's just the money, right? It's the $20 million. I mean, you can get three really good players for the price of one, and the Browns need more help up there than just one guy. Um, now, Alan Lazard is just too similar for me, Dave. He's he's too similar. He is Donovan Peoples-Jones. He is Amari Cooper. He's a, he's a 50-50 bull, a good blocker. He's not going to threaten to, uh, <laughs> you know, uh, lid the, lift the uh, – lid off of a defense or make them change the way they they defend you because he has elite speed or anything like that so i don't really see the point for the browns maybe some other team yeah uh but listen this is a terrible we've talked about this before with you this is not a very good wide receiver free agency class so a lot of these guys are going to get overpaid um just because they're the only available uh, players and listen teams are leaning into the offense they want to take big swings and uh, there's not a lot of big swings to be had right now so guys are going to make more money than they probably should yeah that's one of the reasons i liked your uh, idea with elijah moore as well